G'day scrappers. Today I'm scrapping out a line voltage variation simulator and uh, and a little mainframe here in a little caddy and as well as that they're all made from a Schaefer in Switzerland an interference simulator. So let's check them out. He's basically just slide out. I'll show you the back while I'm here. So it's just one big heatsink there and there we have it. Uh, interesting box, just yeah. Pretty similar to this one. And Okay. So, uh, how's everyone going? Hope everyone's uh, busy picking up some scrap or just having fun with it. Uh, I'm not sure if this part's going to come out. We might have to start just dismantle the whole thing. I think the box is kind of aluminium, so we'll have to break it down anyway. Yeah. Okay. So I haven't really been really busy, uh, did a hospital uh, the other day, so that was pretty good, um, and uh, another small job, but not a whole lot considering we're leading up to the end of the year, and yeah. My competitors have... Uh, Taken over my business. <laughs> um, oh well, good on them. I'm pretty happy to just service my clients and uh, the regular ones that I've still still got. And yeah, uh, maybe pick up the odd occasional new one, but I'm not going to be uh, pushing any advertising uh, from here because. I'm not going to be able to keep up with, um, you know, too many new new clients anyway. Um, yeah, these screws are being really stubborn. So I think I'm going to have to uh, probably drill them out. And there's one. And there they're coming. Oh, this is from the back. <laughs> Didn't even know where I was. Okay, there's a a really nice transformer there. Uh, might be one I'll I'll, I'll keep. Just looks like a nice display transformer. Yeah, you can see the really nice copper pieces. Um,
Yeah. Actually, there's not much really in here apart from the transformer. It's a really pretty transformers. Eh? Yeah, but apart from the odd uh, kind of interesting item, everything is pretty much the same stuff, you know. Uh, PCs, um, most laptops that you know, are too good to scrap, so they're sellable in some way, or um, the ones ones that are for scrap are just sold as is, as scrap, complete. There we have it. Uh, yeah, quite an interesting transformer. Looks pretty neat, doesn't it? And um, yeah. All right. Well, this is just a bit of wire to clean up. Not going to bother. Worry about that box. It's no real good to me. Just want to see what is actually. In this line voltage variation simulator. Okay. Oh, actually, got some pretty good gold pins there. Wow. Really nice. Just wondering how we're going to open this. Side door. We'll have a look. See if there's any good gold recovery value at least. What are you getting a bit of aluminium? Huh? That's pretty Pretty trippy. Yeah, so I was been thinking about, you know, doing a few other things um, on video aside from scrapping, um, but it's still in concept mode, so not sure if I'll go ahead. Okay, we've got some cards in there. Okay. This side might do something. Oh, 
I did a PC um, the other day. I'd done a, a small batch of semi uh, vintage and surprisingly I pulled out a Pentium Pro. Had no idea. Uh, I probably would have saved it to uh, open it up, do it on video, but uh, and it's a uh, quite a nice condition Pentium Pro. Another one to the collection. We don't get very many of them these days, so it was a yeah nice surprise when it came. bit of a jigsaw puzzle. So there we go, we've got uh, a few cards, nothing super spectacular, uh, it just depends on what the IC chips are like. There's one, just one I see. Um, quite interesting. Okay, yeah. Huh. Oh yeah, it's actually got really superb gold fingers. Um, only one sided apart from a little bit there, but they're really really good gold fingers and the IC chips all we need to do remove one and uh, can crack into it Let's see if I can f uh, yeah sometimes it's really hard to see definitely see copper not sure if I can see gold but yeah maybe they may have a little bit of gold in these plastic ICs so I'm just going to depopulate the whole thing take the the ICs off tantalum capacitors and then um, take the gold fingers because they're definitely very good very good fingers nice Yep, there you go. Pretty cool. Oh, this heavy little thing, but it's still got some good piece of gold finger on there. And then uh, definitely these plugs. They got really great um, gold plating on them, so they'll be good. And the rest is just uh, cleaning up a little bit of wire. So. Oh, and obviously can't forget these really nice gold pins. Uh, once I undo this, be able to slide each each pin out. Really good, higher grade for gold recovery. Same with this one by the looks, but it doesn't look like it's got many cards. I'll just open the back up. We do have one removable IC chip on this card, but there's nothing in there apart from a, just a low grade. And well, actually, this board here is quite nice, got a lot of IC chips on it at least. They just make it awkward <laughs> to um, pull them apart. Yeah, <coughs> this uh, <coughs> board's got quite a few 
removable ICs, um, but not a great deal actually. Some interesting components, some gold plated stuff, so looks like copper coils, um, nice looking copper coils. Nice copper going through there. Yeah, that was yeah, reasonably interesting. Um, you know, the gold fingers are certainly good, great for uh, gold recovery. In some of them, and the transformer. And the first one was quite interesting. Um, it's just a, a pretty looking transformer, really. And um, yeah, looks like there's quite a lot of copper running through it. And yeah, that was it. So, they're our, uh, oh gosh, what were they called? So this one was the interference simulator. And the other one was the line voltage variation simulator. Okay, line voltage sim, interference sim. Interesting. All right. Well, that was just a little, <laughs> little quick scrap. Uh, I do have more oddball, unusual things. I'm just having a look. Uh, it, it's the uh, time of year uh, when I oh, sort my camera out and um, get into the garage and start cleaning out. It's actually really good. I've been working on it and uh, just loading up the van with uh, things that are going off to sell and and yeah so uh, um, yeah usual time of year when I've got to uh, I want to clear out the garage and uh, clear all this area up get rid of all my boards and my uh, copper wire and uh, batteries and so on steel and uh, yeah I'll just continue on just uh, this is just from the recent pickup just some PC some service and uh, oddball things like that and just boxes that I haven't sorted through yet. Huh. So I thought I'd just do a quick little catch up and um, yeah, hopefully uh, I start getting more interesting things or more interesting ideas to uh, scrap uh, on video and do on video. Um, like I said, I will do a scrap metal run soon, uh, get the prices for the end of year, see how where we end up. Um, that should be good. And uh, yeah, all right guys, Quick one, keep scrapping, have fun, and I'll catch you next one.